Hello, and welcome to my website. My name is Doug Conant, and I have been the president and CEO of the Campbell Soup Company for the past 10 years. During that time, we've taken our company to new heights in terms of financial performance, employee engagement, diversity and inclusion, corporate social responsibility, and much more. Together with our 20,000 employees, we have made Campbell a destination company in the consumer products industry. Before joining Campbell in 2001, I had the opportunity to have quality executive experiences with three other iconic food companies, General Mills, Kraft, and Nabisco, two of which are terrific turnaround stories. As I moved to retirement from Campbell later this year, I've decided to share the lessons from my 35-year corporate leadership journey with interested next-generation leaders. That is the purpose of this website. Within the website, you'll find a rich discussion of my experience with Campbell. You'll find important information on a new book on leadership called Touch Points, which I've co-authored with my friend and colleague, Meta Norgard. You'll find a review of the lessons I've learned during my 35-year corporate journey. You'll find a review of some of my favorite reading materials, and you'll find much more. Over time, I've whittled my purpose as a leader down to 15 words. My purpose is to help build world-class organizations that defy the critics and thrive in the face of adversity. I believe that leaders may be born, but they are most certainly made. I treat my leadership work as a craft, and to me, it is sacred ground not in a religious sense, but in the sense that it reflects who I am and what I believe in. And to me, that is sacred ground. I believe that leadership is a performance-based idea. If you perform, you get the privilege of leading. If you don't, you don't. I also believe that leadership is all about the people with whom you work. To succeed, their heads and hearts need to be fully in the game. To that end, three key themes emerge in my leadership thinking. The first theme is built around the need to be tough-minded with standards of performance and tender-hearted with people. By this, I mean that in every business, high performance against high standards is imperative. But at the same time, high performance in a team-based environment without people who are personally engaged in the work, I believe, is impossible. If, as a leader, you want people to be personally engaged in the work, they need to feel that you are personally engaged in their situation and committed to their well-being. To me, it won't work in an enduring fashion any other way. A second theme you will find running through my thinking is the notion that the soft stuff is the hard stuff. In my experience, most issues in the workplace are issues of understanding and communication not issues of return on investment analysis. A third theme you will find in my philosophy is that ultimately, effective leadership is all about behavior, not rhetoric. It's about what you do, not just about what you say. I believe that as a leader, your performance will be determined by how you behave in each moment. If you're effective, you'll win. If you're not, you'll lose. It is that straightforward. To that end, my friend and colleague, Meta Norgard, and I have developed a leadership concept called Touch Points, which is all about creating powerful leadership connections in the smallest of moments. To be clear, our Touch Points concept is not meant to be a treatise on leadership, but to me, it is a very powerful piece of the puzzle. Touch Points are where the rubber meets the road. In a nutshell, this is the territory covered by my leadership thinking. It is anchored in a very studied way through a practitioner's eyes. I've been in your shoes. Now, with this website, I'm giving you a chance to be in mine. Enjoy the ride.